Hi, I'm Heinbach and it's good to have you back. This little wooden box in the middle of the screen is the Seat Lombard Benjolin, a tiny analog synthesizer that can best be described as a source of inspiration, as it will generate riffs and musical patterns all by itself. I've been playing it for a while now and it never fails to give me ideas for tracks. Originally, the Benjolin is a design by the late Rob Hordyke from 2009. According to my friend and fellow synthesist Richard Scott, who knew him more closely, it was Rob's love letter to the DIY community, a chance for him to travel and make workshops building it and to spread the word about his lovingly crafted modular systems, of which only 80 exist. Richard has one of those systems, but he also has what he calls an anomaly. The Benjolin exists as a circuit diagram for other people to build, but Rob built two in the style of his famed Blippo box.
Peter Blesser of Seattle Lombard met Rob in 2009 when he hosted a Benjamin building workshop for him in Baltimore. He was inspired by Rob's ideas and circuits like the Wrangler, which lies at the heart of the Benjamin, found their way into his own instruments. But this is the first time he's playing by the sheet, as he told me. But still, he has his own voice as a designer and in his hands it becomes a little pocket book of synthesizer poetry. I gave feedback to Peter in the creation process, as we listened both on the bench and at my studio. <laughs> As a thank you, I got to keep the first production unit, of which a hundred exist right now. The Benjolin interfaces easy with the outside world, as it got an audio input, so you can use it to process other instruments. It's semi-modular, so it integrates perfectly with other modular synthesizers, though you might need some adapters for Eurorack. <laughs> Benjolin is simple yet deep. It has two oscillators, a filter with resonance and the Wrangler. The Wrangler uses a shift register like the famed Source of Uncertainty from Buchler to create musical chaos. There are outputs for square waves, triangle waves, stepped, a CV in for the filter, a filtered out and a ground. This means you can sequence it externally.
I met Rob at Noodlefest in Rotterdam in 2017, the very first thing he said to me was, young man, when you're my age, you're not looking to become popular. You're looking to become a legend. I found that to be a bit of a bold opening for the first thing to say to someone, but maybe he had at that time already an inkling that he wouldn't be around forever. And in 2022, he passed away. But his instruments, his circuits and his ideas live on. And I've no doubt that the Siat Van Bart version, along with all the other versions of the Benjolin, will contribute to his lasting legacy. If you are on my Patreon, as you should be, there's a big sound pack of Benjolin sounds waiting for you, as well as music from this video. If you have any more questions, put them in the comments below. And I'll be seeing you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye.